Alright, hey, this is the uh, superb set type video for September 11th of 2020. Um, I'm, I'm gonna make an announcement today, but just to get things out of the way, I'm extremely disappointed that no one uploaded this week. Well, MC did. No one else. I, I'm, I'm gonna be the last one that ever uploads on this channel. Which is why, starting tomorrow, September 12th, on my birthday, I'm restarting my YouTube channel. If, if, if you go to youtube.com slash background9225, there will be a video there tomorrow on the 12th. I'm not going to give you a time. Just check check back sometime tomorrow. There will be a video there. I'm restarting up a Let's Play of um, Legend of Zelda Spirit Tracks. I was originally going to play through Pokemon Heart Gold again, considering that was the first video ever on my channel. But, um, plans changed with that, and I'm delaying that until later. It, it still has the same meaning, not as meaningful, but, it, you know. Um, aside from that, though, I'm also planning on reacting to a few of my original videos, because that's just going to be a cringe fest. It's fun for everyone. Um, I'm going to make one of those, and if that does well, I'll react to the rest of them. Because I, I have a lot of old videos. There's like 10 or 12, maybe. Which isn't, isn't a lot, but it's a lot to react to, if you know what I mean. Long videos. Um, but aside from that, it's been another week. Not much changed. We had that, uh, surprise Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity announcement, which, oh boy, that was amazing. I've never been more excited for, well, actually, no. That's a lie. It's probably most excited when the, uh, Breath of the Wild release date trailer came out. It's probably the most excited I've been for a game. But I was, I was still very excited for uh, Age of Calamity. It looks amazing. It's like almost everything I wanted out, wanted out of a sequel slash another Breath of the Wild-ish game. Um, the Hyrule Warriors gameplay style very fitting to the, the War of the Calamity. And uh... I, I really want to see more of the champions because I love them as characters, so I, I can't complain. It's like it's like a dream come true in a lot of ways. Just, I, I, at, at some point in the past, they even fantasized of like a game where you get to play as the champions and you know watch them them fail and die and s see the kingdom actually falling apart due to the calamity. I, I know it's a very dark game, but like, I want to see that kind of stuff. That's what makes Breath of the Wild interesting, because it is a very dark Zelda game. I mean, not quite as directly dark as like Majora's Mask, but it's it's the subtle kind of dark. Where you're like, oh, millions died. This kingdom's gonna have to take years to prepare. Yeah. Also, I'm really curious to see if they'll introduce characters or something and then carry that over to Breath of the Wild 2. Because, like, there's that little egg guardian thing, and I assume he'll be relevant to the story or maybe an important character. So, what happened to him? Did he die too? Did he get lost and then Link and Zelda go find him and the sequel? Are there other characters that are going to be introduced that we're going to see a hundred years later in the sequel? I mean, I doubt it, considering unless they're like Azora, or a, a Gerudo, or not a Gerudo, a Goron, probably not going to be alive, but, you know, be interesting. Um, aside from that, there was also that, uh, Hall Live EN announcement, the, the official English VTubers. They're, they're doing their debuts tomorrow, so I can't wait to 
spend my entire birthday watching real-life animal from 4 a.m. to 6 p.m. and maybe longer. It's just gonna dedicate my entire day to that. But they look interesting. Um, I don't really hate any of them. I, I, I if there were like, if like to name one that I'm the least interested in, it would probably be um, Kira. Kira. She's not as interesting. Just, just like her whole thing as of right now is that she's a phoenix. I don't know what's going on with her, her sword or her shield. Um, everyone just calls her a chicken, so that's hilarious. And it, is it not cannibalism as a phoenix to want to s serve fast food, specifically specifying in bird products? That seems like cannibalism to me. Hmm. Concerning. But, uh, yeah, okay, yeah, 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 shark girl, she's adorable, um, Amelia, she, she's got the whole detective thing going on, I'm sure she's gonna be, like, very Sherlock Holmesy. that's gonna be interesting, she's also, um, interviewing everyone else, so I'm sure she's gonna be, like, the head slash updater for the whole group slash project. Um, I don't know how to say her name because it's weird and long. In Ina Nis, Ina, Ina. Tentacle monster. That one. Kusulu. She's interesting, and I'm sure the internet loves her because, you know, anime girl, tentacles. That, that's just a, a dream combination. Um, I like her whole sanity check thing. It's very funny. I find that, that very funny that her streams are just sanity checks. Here, watch me become sane again. I know the world's ending right now, but, but, but watch a beautiful tentacle monster. You know, for sanity's sake. There's also, um, I don't know how to say her name either. They got weird names. Calliope? Calliope. I don't know. Um, something like that. She's like the Grim Reaper's assistant. Love her design. It's amazing. The, the, the pink clashing with black, it's amazing. Um, I still like the fact that she's a rapper. Her, her whole... I don't know what the word is. Just the way she speaks in general is very interesting. So I'm excited to see her stream. But, you know, they look interesting. Gonna be watching that. Um, I don't really know anything about Hollow Live aside from that. I I've, I've seen the adorable pupper and keys in the eye. I don't even know if she's a uh, Hollow Live or if she was just a first virtual YouTuber. I don't know. I don't know nothing about Hollow Live. But I've seen like a handful of them around. But I don't I don't keep myself updated on it or I know a lot about it because I have to learn Japanese. That's that's you know the great thing about the uh, Hollow Live EM is English. It's, it's it's for us uncultured individuals that slash weebs who don't understand Japanese. There's, there's male VTubers called Hollow Stars. I, I'd love some English Hollow Stars. That'd be great. Because um, all the Hollow Stars that I saw, they they were great. I I totally watched them. If, you know, they didn't speak Japanese. I mean, I'm sure I could still watch their streams anyways. Because probably fan translations are they have subtitles, but still, it has a lot of content to go through. I don't know if I want to watch, like, uh, 
10, 20 streamers. I don't know, it's a lot. There's already people that I watch that stream and I don't watch their streams because they're too long. I, I, have, I have a watch later list that's like over 190% of the time and there's so many shows that I want to watch that I just never get to. I'm just stacking more content onto it that I'm never going to get it through. I'm productive. But yeah, um, that's it. I don't want to make this video too long in case it breaks. Because I can't trust the new camera now, apparently. Also, upload times are horrible on my computer. I don't know if it's the increase in quality from my camera, or the way my computer connects to the internet. Question mark. I don't know. But the last video that I uploaded that was like 11 minutes, that took hours to get out. Also, I can't draw out this video too long because if it's over 15 minutes I don't think I'll be able to upload it because Lomi hasn't verified the channel and refused to show any signs of life so I don't trust him to verify it. So, you know. I'm gonna end this here. See you next week. Check out my channel tomorrow. Please, please, please say happy birthday. Don't forget. Don't won't be a bobby and be like, oh, I don't remember your birthday. I I'm sure, I'm sure he didn't mean it like that, but, you know, gotta make fun of him somehow. See you next week.